So I'd like to introduce you to a new program that we've installed on your MacBook. It's called Formulator Pro. Formulator Pro allows you to open and edit PDF files. To begin, open up Autom or Formulator Pro from your Applications Directory. If you go to File and Open, you can choose a, a PDF document. These would be documents that maybe you had scanned in and sent from the copier. I'm going to open one up. I'm going to resize the window so I can see it better. I can zoom in and out on it with the tools at the top left. I'm going to go ahead and zoom in on this one. Okay. Just about have it resized here. And uh, I'm just showing you some stuff here from the top menus. Over here is the toolbar. And you have the options to add circles, text, scribbles, or check marks. I'll go ahead and use the scribble here to show you. I can handwrite my name or whatever. Uh, it may not be extremely handy for that, but it's very possible. Okay. With this, I can also circle stuff on the actual page. I wanted to highlight something in particular or underline a particular word. I could make it really easy to do that. And black might not be the best choice. And so I'm going to go up here and actually change the uh, the color. Okay, so you can choose red. Red's going to show up much better here. So I can do the same thing, circle or underline, uh, anything I want to do anywhere I can put the mouse. If I want predetermined circles that are prettier, I can use the uh, oval making tool to drop those in place. If I want to write text on the file, I'm going to go ahead and create a text box and start typing. You can easy, easily add text to a PDF, which is nice for a change. I want to change colors of my font. I simply just go back over to the uh, color chooser wheel and choose a different color. And now I just start typing again and it's in the blue. Another handy tool you might find is the uh, check boxes here. And if you were grading something, you could easily add check boxes next to correct or incorrect items. Now I'm going to go ahead and uh, file and save as <clears throat> and save this document out as my document. And this does allow you to edit it and then save it out as a new document. In this case I'm going to go ahead and create it as my corrected assignment and I'm going to save it out to my desktop. And I'm going to go ahead and close out and then reopen it. And voila, here's my document with all my edited changes. Hope this uh, tool helps you guys out. It's going to be available to both staff and students.